touching back to this. And this is not going to be a gang politic conversation. However, we are going to talk about some real shit at a certain point that I want I want this message to get out to y'all. Because a lot of y'all do participate in this bullshit that follow me. I'll be mean, seeing y'all at the gas station. Now, nah, blood really just fuck with you, bro, on the mob. Like, anyway, but long story short, I am well aware of the recent arrest of five quote-unquote alleged um, affiliates of the EBK camp. This took place from an unwarranted search and seizure house raiding in its uh, home in Stockton about a day ago now. Um, five members, one of them a 17-year-old, were taken on weapon charges, etc., etc. Now, the reason why I want to talk about this is because, for what I understand, this was unwarranted. There was no reason at all given. They just said, hey, we're going to come raid the house, which lets me know that they got tipped off to a certain extent. And I am 99% sure that that tip off probably had something to do with the internet to some degree, be it these posts that y'all put on Instagram be it these posts that y'all put on Facebook, these messages that y'all send out between y'all. I'm going to tell y'all a secret about the cops. And I'm not a cop, but I do do security on a federal level, so some of this shit I do know. You would be surprised how uninformed cops are about certain things without the help of Instagram, without the help of Facebook, without the help of YouTube. I swear on my grandma, I swear, you would be shocked. And... Y'all give them, I always tell people, bro, if you even to some degree, allegedly, because this is just allegedly, allegedly, if you are even to some degree allegedly involved in street shit, if your ass, as my daddy used to say, if your ass is participating in the street Olympics to some degree, you should not have Instagram, bro. You should not have Instagram. You should not have Facebook. You should not have YouTube. And you damn sure should not have it and have in your name the the um the net like the the acronym for whatever click you attach to particularly where there's an open investigation to saying that you guys are a gang and this is just common sense this is just common sense and it ain't just them it ain't just y'all a lot of these little boys whether it be in california whether it be in, in missouri i'm watching what's going on with the boys in st louis they they all do that but it, you can't do that and a lot of y'all, we we can make this a conversation about the younger generation, but it ain't just a younger generation. Our parents are stupid too. Our parents are stupid too. We all, I'm from that age where all of our dads and uncles was Crips, Bloods, and all that other shit. That's my generation. And all of them went to jail for 15, 14 years or some shit. My daddy did 13. And I have to imagine that some of that had to be due, them getting caught, some of that had to be due to the 45,000 photos that our uncles and dads took posing with the Crip gang, with the blood, the C, the P. Yeah, we all got an uncle who took the picture with the P, like the, the, the P shit, bro. Like, all that, bro. Like, that is going to get your ass locked up. You know, just keep on with you. So, hey.